search to find 30 Barclays Ball Kids to appear at the 2013 Barclays ATP World Tour Finals kicked off in the spring with regional selection trials for thousands of hopefuls at 14 venues across the UK. After weeks of assessments, the Talent ID team handpicked the very best to appear at the national trials. We're looking for the kids with the agility, concentration, that little bit of X factor. Have they got that inner confidence to come out, prove themselves, you know, and be above the rest, try as hard as they can at every exercise they do. Or last year the teams were, you know, in my opinion, I think they were the best ones so far. So really up to 2013's team, you know, can they be the best yet? 2012 Barclays Ball Kid of the Year, Prashant Degal knows better than most exactly what it takes to make the grade, but he says the rewards are well worth the effort. It's a lot of commitment to become a ball kid, you know, you go to two trials and there's loads of new people, you probably do new tasks you've never done before, and the, the, the skills you learn, it's more than physical skills, it's sort of mentally, you've got to apply yourself correctly, and I, I think it helped me at school really, because I was never really bothered before, whereas now I've got the confidence of not only being a ball kid, but you know, being lucky enough to pick as ball kid of the year, fantastic gave me confidence in everything I do so I can you know I can prepare myself and mentally apply myself for anything. For the newest applicants motivation isn't hard to come by particularly if they've had the advantage of witnessing the thrill of the world's biggest indoor tournament first hand. My sister did it a couple of years ago and obviously I went to go and watch her and I just saw because when she was leaving she was crying and it it must have meant everything to her and then I was like I, I just have to do that I want that same feeling so so yeah, that's how I, that's why I wanted to do it. It just seems like an incredible experience to sort of be on court with all the players. I've seen it on TV and it just looks amazing. The world's best players demand the world's best ball kids. And for the 30 youngsters ultimately chosen to appear alongside the top eight players on the planet at the O2 in November, the journey is only just beginning.